Hello friends, this is Dr. Atul Kumar Vaibhav and I have done my MBBS from AIMS Patna. I am of 2010-19 batch and I secured All India rank of 694 in the NEET PG 2025 examination in my first attempt and I had also got All India rank of 2579 in INICT May 2025. So friends, as you know that there is still no sign of beginning of the NEET PG 2025 counselling and also there is no sign of the uh, application form of INICT November 2025. So I have decided to prepare, considering all these circumstances, I have decided to prepare for INICT 2025 November attempt. But whether I'll give it or not give it uh, will depend uh, on the NEET PG 2025 counselling and whether I'll get my desired uh, college or my desired branch or not. So it will depend on that finally. But uh, uh, meanwhile, I am preparing for INICT November 2025. As I have done uh, my UG also from a central institute, an institute of national importance. So I know how central institutes and these AIMS uh, are. AIMS is one of the you know best places to do your UG or your PG from. So considering these things, I am currently preparing for INICT. So uh, in this video, I, I have uh, talked about what I did uh, in this past week. That is from 13th of September to 20th of September. That is today. So in this past one week, what I have studied, which questions I have solved and from which platforms, uh, uh, this I'm going to share to you uh, in order to uh, guide you or uh, in your preparation and it is sort of a let's prepare together kind of thing so that I am also preparing and you can also take uh, uh, some guidance or inspiration or so in your journey as well from this. So uh, I decided to pre uh, keep the BTR test and discussion schedule as my uh, base schedule you know which i uh, which i have to follow so this schedule i decided to follow that i will study according to this schedule only and this i started from 13th of uh, september okay from 13th of september i decided to seriously start for the, the uh, start the preparation once again on 8th of september i did give one gt and i have uploaded a video of that also on my channel you can go and watch after this video uh, if you want to uh, so i gave that gt on 8th of september but seriously i decided to prepare from this 13th september so, and i decided to follow this schedule so uh, in this, I want to tell you that on 31st, uh, this 31st August 1, the Integrated Systems Part 3 Renal plus GTI, this test I had given. Okay, I had not prepared that much, but I had given. But apart from that, I had not given any of the other tests. So this week, I was supposed to give the orthopedics one and the PSM one. These two were supposed to be given by me you know, in this week. And also, this was my uh, base uh, schedule, the base uh, schedule, okay, which I decided to follow. And this one, which is the cerebellum, INICT 3.0 END of the INIC, uh, of INICT, which is currently going on. This I decided to follow as an accessory schedule means I will not study uh, anything, okay, whichever test will be there in this uh, schedule, I will not study for it, I will just give it. But uh, the BTR, for the BTR test, I will study and I will give, that I had thought, okay, so this was supposed to be my main uh, schedule and this was meant to be my accessory schedule. So according to this microbiology test was scheduled this week, so I was supposed to give this microbiology test too, okay. So uh, considering this, I uh, started my preparation, so I will give you date-wise what I did, so this was... Uh, in total what I uh, did in you know all these days so in uh, from 13th of September to 20th of September I solved five grand tests I gave seven custom modules two mini tests and four test and discussions out of the four test and discussions I solved uh, three of them and I watched the video of uh, one of them I will tell you all about it so first of all a disclaimer that uh, this is what I have done in this uh, one week okay and as you will see that I was not able to uh, you know fully cope up with the schedule which I had made I will tell you about that also but one thing is there that this is not meant uh, to be followed as it is if you are deciding to follow as I always say that you should follow whatever you are following you should do whatever you are doing but there is no harm in taking one or two good things from here and there and incorporate into your preparation as well so this is that uh, maybe this will serve as one of those things which you take from here and there and which might help you in your journey okay this is not at all uh, the ideal way of doing things. The ideal way is something different, which will I'll, which I'll tell you at the end, which, what is what should be the ideal way of doing the things and which I will also try to do from, you know, the, the next week. But this is what I did this week. So I did not write beforehand what I have to do every day. I just wrote uh, those things which I did, you know, I kept on doing the things. The basic goal was at the back of the mind that uh, I have to give ortho TND and uh, CFM TND and um, this micro TND. These three things were at the back of my mind and the rest all the things which I kept on doing. And then after doing those things, I kept on writing. And which you can, uh, you can see here, there is written in the bracket R and the, the Dates. The R means I reviewed when I reviewed that particular thing that is written uh, by uh, that that uh, this R stands for that. So now what I did on 13th on the 13th uh, which was Friday last week. Okay, so I did ortho BTR. So ortho BTR 2.0 video I watched. Then I gave the pre PG INICT practice GT one. So there are in the pre PG app there uh, there are 15 INICT GTs. Okay, so out of those 15 INICT GTs I gave the first one. So what was my score in that? So you can see that I scored 146 correct and 54 wrong in that. Okay. 
so that was uh, uh, that i attempted on september 13th so this was one gt which i gave that day and then what i did was i did uh, marrow based 50 questions custom module from wwa means from the uh, from a whatsapp group so there is a whatsapp group which uh, sends uh, in which these custom modules come so i uh, solved the, the, that custom module and that custom module was of octa ent and psm okay so that 50 questions i did and i reviewed it uh, the next day on 14th and then uh, there was this marrow uh, 50 questions from a telegram group which i had joined i have now left the group but uh, i had joined that telegram group in which uh, 50 questions came so that I, those 50 questions i gave i, I did on uh, 13th and reviewed on 14th and then i watched the extra edge videos btr ortho videos so this extra edge video i watched on 13th so uh, on 14th i was supposed to give the uh, ortho tnd but I did not give because you know nothing goes as per the plan so on 14th because i have this habit of solving gts and also once i started solving gts i just you know gave another gt only so first of all this um, on 14th what i did i gave the digi nerve gt so i was scrolling through instagram and i saw that there is this uh, digi nerve is uh, uh, conducting one gt one free gt of the ini ct model so i gave it on 14th so uh, and then also i gave a prep ladder gt on the same day prep ladder gt and then again 50 questions custom module i did from the whatsapp group which i talked about and that was of medicine so what i uh, so how was my performance in the digi nerve gt so you, as you can see that in the in the digi nerve gt my uh, uh, score was 170 correct and 30 incorrect rank was 12 out of 319 students okay so this is what uh, happened in digi nerve gt and then i gave the prep ladder gt as i told you so this is the prep ladder gt score the second one here so in that uh, i got 153 correct and 47 incorrect and my percentile was 99.78 and my rank was 7 out of 300 1092 students so all India rank in this prep ladder GT was 7th, okay. So this was my prep ladder GT which I gave on 14th. And then what I, uh, so this 14th is sorted out. Now coming to 15th. On 15th, uh, I revised, I reviewed this these two GTs which I gave the last day. So these two, two things I did. And then on 50, uh, 15th, I did marrow uh, questions from that WhatsApp group. And that was of psychiatry subject this time, okay. And then I gave reflex hammer quiz. There is a hammer quiz conducted by the reflex. They keep on sending this email to everybody, okay. And if anyone wins, then they give one year sub free subscri subscription of the reflex app. So I solved that uh, reflex hammer quiz on 15th and i reviewed the uh, that on 17th okay i reviewed the answers on 17th so this was 15th so on 15th these two things i did and then i reviewed the previous days two gts so that i did on 15th then now coming to 16th on 16th i did very less thing i uh, just reviewed this uh, marrow 50 questions which i did of psychiatry that i reviewed and apart from that i gave one uh, another set uh, of 50 questions uh, custom module which came on that whatsapp group this was of dharma now so dharma uh, uh, one i did and that i revised on the same day itself on 16th so now 16th september is sorted now coming to 17th on 17th i gave the pre pg inict gt Two. So the second GT I gave out of those 15 GTs, one I gave on the first day and this second one I gave on 17th. And then I also gave one Reflex INICT GT. So in the Reflex app also there are GTs. I think there are three INICT GTs and one NITPG based GT is there in the Reflex app. So in the pre-PG app and Reflex app, these two GTs I gave on 17th and then again Marrow 50 question custom module from that WhatsApp group I gave and that was combined module of Dharma plus medicine. So that I did that day. Uh, and I reviewed it on the same day, but these two GTs I reviewed the next day. So how much, what was my performance in these two GTs? So it was C. Uh, in the pre-PG, uh, INICT practice test 2, I got 152 correct and 48 incorrect. So that I gave on uh, 17th. And then this is the Reflex app. This is this one is of Reflex app. So in the Reflex GT1, um, I got 157 correct and uh, 43 incorrect. And uh, you can see that my rank was 67 out of 1100. 18 students so 67 rank out of 1018 students so this i gave on 17th so now 17th is done now coming to 18th what i did on 18th i watched this prep ladder uh, patho inict tnd uh, discussion okay so i was supposed to study for the uh, psm tnd which was on uh, 19th which was supposed to be conducted on 19th so on 18th i had to i was supposed to study psm btr 2.0 and then i was also supposed to study the extra edge of the PSM but I was unable to do it because you know I don't feel like studying anymore I am telling you the truth and it may it might be happening with many of you so I think the best thing which you can do right now all those of you who cannot focus on revising through the same stuff again and again you should approach this question based approach only I think it will be very helpful so what I did that day on 18th I gave the, I uh, viewed the prep ladder patho INI CT TND video okay so there was this test and discussion video which was streaming on YouTube so of Preeti ma'am so I watched the patho INI CT and it had a test and discussion video I did not so I did not give that test, but I watched the INICT test and discussion video and it consisted of 80 questions and some extra questions were also discussed by Preeti Mem in the test. So there were a lot of questions. So it was, I think, five hours, more than five hours long, but uh, I watched uh, it in uh, two weeks. So, but still it took um, considerable amount of time. So that I did on 18th. And then uh, I also solved 50 uh, custom modules as usual. This is, this is a regular thing which I do because every day this custom module keeps on coming in that group. So this was of surgery. So surgery custom module of marrow I solved. So now uh, this was 18th. Now on 19th, I was supposed to give the TND of, uh, you know, CSM, but I did not give it and I did not uh, till now I, I did not give any TND which was supposed to be given by me neither 
सी एफ एम नीदर नॉर ऑर्थो एंड नॉट इवन माइक्रोबायोलॉजी सो वॉट आई डिड ऑन नाइनटीन सो आई डिड दिस फिजियोलॉजी मिनी टेस्ट विच वॉज ऑन मैरो ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन है ना एंड देन देर वॉज दिस एनाटमी मिनी टेस्ट ऑन मैरो अगेन ट्वेंटी क्वेश्चन एंड देन अगेन दिस रेगुलर कस्टम मॉड्यूल थिंग ऑफ द मैरो ऑफ दिस वॉज ऑफ एन एस टी शिया दैट डे ओके सो वॉट हैपेंड इन ऑन दिस नाइनटीन द टू मिनी टेस्ट आई विल शो यू सो इन द फर्स्ट मिनी टेस्ट विच वॉज ऑफ दिस फिजियोलॉजी सो इन दिस फिजियो इंटीग्रेटेड मिनी टेस्ट विच आई टू ऑन नाइनटीन ऑफ फिजियो वेरी बैड परफॉर्मेंस थर्ट ओनली थर्टीन करेक्ट एंड सेवेंटीन सेवन वॉज सेवन इन करेक्ट एटी एट पॉइंट थ्री सिक्स परसेंट टाइम रैंक वॉज सी वन थ्री जीरो फाइव आउट ऑफ वन वन टू जीरो एट then i gave anatomy uh, mini test 20 questions again now this time the performance was good 18 correct 2 incorrect 99.43 percentile and the rank was 120th out of uh, 20889 so this was the uh, predicted rank okay so this is what i did on uh, 19th now coming on to 20th that is today so what i did today so today i already had these three backlogs of these three test and discussions so i completed the backlog today so first i did the btr ortho tnd and i reviewed only the incorrect questions i have not viewed the test and discussion videos which i will view today but till now i have not viewed then btr cfm text and discussion i watched of uh, i i solved and i reviewed only the incorrect questions okay and explanations were given this time in the test so i just quickly went through only the incorrect the questions which i got incorrect so this these uh, these two things i have done today and then the third thing which i did today was the cerebellum end uh, micro one okay the in set inict micro which was conducted on 14th that also i gave today and i also same thing i did here also i reviewed the incorrect questions okay so but i will watch all these test and discussion videos also today but till now i have not watched but i have reviewed the incorrect questions okay so what was my performance in these uh, three so it was in the psm1 it was 71 correct and 29 incorrect i had not studied at, at all psm as you can as you know as i told you in this video because i was not in the mood of studying as many of you might be uh, also having the same mood right now so uh, i i did not have the mood to study so i did not study and just gave the test and my score was so bad 71 correct 29 incorrect rank was 179 out of 2511 students and mm, 93rd percentile so very bad so after that i gave Uh, the orthopedics btr orthopedics orthopedics i had studied but uh, on 13th right i had told you right on 13th of september i had studied so this i gave in this uh, my correct was 65 correct and 15 incorrect and this is some glitch in the app something they are showing 0th percentile but they are showing the correct rank here 116 out of 3777 3777 students it was 116 rank in ortho so that i gave and then i gave the microbiology end inict 3.0 uh, and in it my performance was 83 correct and 17 incorrect in spite of getting this these many corrects and these uh, So only 17 incorrect. Uh, my rank was just 449 out of 285, which is pretty bad. 83rd percentile, which is pretty bad. So, but it is a memory heavily memory based subject, microbiology, and I had, as you know, not revised anything of microbiology. I just sat and gave the test. So this is what I did this past week in my preparation journey towards INICT 2025 November attempt. So. as i told if you can uh, take uh, some tips then or some guidance or some inspiration from this then you can definitely take but this is not the ideal method ideally what i should have done was that i should have uh, watched the btr 2.0 videos then i should have uh, watched the btr extra edge videos and after the extra edge videos i should have watched the compiled modules of that particular subject if any for example the compiled modules uh, of the yeah, park textbook is present so compiled park i should have watched before giving the cfm uh, test okay so this i should have done these three things i videos i should have watched but i will try to watch uh, these things for the upcoming test i will try to stick to my schedule and i will keep posting videos too then what i should have done was i should have done the previous year questions okay the custom modules previous year questions of that particular subject of which of whose uh, uh, tnd or end i was supposed to give for example i i should have given the pyqs of uh, the psm i should have uh, used the tags hashtag inict or hashtag uh, you know Uh, in the custom modules hashtag aims i should have used these tags and i should have solved pyqs before uh, giving the tnd so this should have been the ideal approach and then i should have given the tnds or ends okay but this i did not do so next week i will try to do these things and plus i will try to give as many again I, because gts i like to give gts and i have seen the power of gts so therefore i will give uh, as many gts as possible next week also so friends this is what i did okay this week so may i will post many there are many videos uh, which will come up regarding what resources i used for neat pg 2025 and how to avoid silly mistakes and how btr helped me uh, and how to appropriately use btr how to add stuff into btr how to uh, which resources apart from btr you must be doing subject wise all these different kinds of videos will come eventually in this channel so you may subscribe the channel and thanks for watching this video hope you liked it